<laughs> Democracy in America. You know, the, the, the true test of someone's character is how they behave under fire. The other side wants to take away your freedom of speech. Not true that it was. What, 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 did, what, what did YouTube tell you? The, there was no reason given to me, or to, and, as, and I could not discern any reason from any public statements by YouTube about why they were taken down. Uh, someone at YouTube takes down your video, um, and typically the, the, reason is, the reason given is they says it's because he wasn't following the science. And here you have a medical degree, a PhD, an undergrad degree from, 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 from the university. Uh, what was in the video that they found offensive? Or, or, you know, again, we don't know the reason, but what was in the video? What did you well, say? I, the, main, the main thing that was in the video that I said I think was, was, a, was set them off was that I said that there are no randomized studies that show that masks uh, work with children. Democracy in America. And free speech. Free speech is the bedrock of democracy. Democracy in America. <laughs> How they behave under fire. The other side wants to take away your freedom of speech. YouTube, it's expanding its crackdown on COVID misinformation. The company reports it's now banning all anti-vax videos. YouTube already had a policy against COVID vaccine misinformation, but the new ban includes any content that falsely claims approved vaccines of any kind are dangerous or ineffective. YouTube says it also removed the accounts of several prominent anti-vax activists. YouTube reports it's also taking down all videos that relate or violate those rules. CNBC's Perry Russum is here now. Perry, what's considered misinformation and what's not? So the new guidelines mean you cannot post videos that have harmful misinformation about vaccine safety. And here are some of the examples they are talking about. That approved vaccines cause autism, that they cause infertility or have microchips so you can be tracked. They will allow videos that debate the scientific process, vaccine policies, and personal testimonials related to vaccines, as long as the channel does not show a pattern of promoting vaccine hesitancy. If you violate the policy, YouTube gets rid of the video. They send you an email, three strikes within 90 days, and your channel is out. It is deleted. They can also delete your channel after what they call a single case of severe abuse, and they've already started deleting channels of anti-vax influencers. If, if people don't know what's, what's going on, if they don't know the truth, democracy in America. <laughs> you must have free speech in order to have democracy. That's why it's the First Amendment. And the, and the Second Amendment is there to ensure that we have the First Amendment. The other side wants to take away your freedom of speech, freedom of speech, freedom of speech. <laughs> Now, voting. How, I, I still can't believe that's real. Who do you want representing America? As you can see, I'm, I'm, I'm not just MAGA, I'm dark MAGA. Voting. I, I, I still can't believe that's real. Voting is just meaningless. If, if people don't know what's, what's going on, if they don't know the truth, how can you, how can you make an informed vote? How, I, I still can't believe that's real. Voting. They want to take away your right to vote effectively? Voting is just meaningless. <laughs> Democracy in America. Yes. So I have I have one one ask for everyone in the audience. Everyone. So uh, many times during um, spacewalks outside the International Space Station, we can see air bubbles rising up. Can you touch on how there are air bubbles in space? So yeah, like a lot of times during the footage, the NASA footage, you can see bubbles coming up out of the helmets or kind of from underneath you. Um, how do you explain bubbles in space? Yeah, I, I'm not sure exactly what you're talking about.
Could it, could it be that you're filming in an underwater pool and you're not really out there? <laughs> Alright, well I just encourage everyone to look up Bubbles in Space, hashtag Bubbles in Space. Thank you very much. Thank you. I got him free. And uh, I, th I think this, this, this election, I think it's the most important election of our lifetime. You say this it's is the most fair. important election in, in decades. And it's, that, that's a, a line we hear often during election season. This is the most important election of our lifetime. This is the most important election of our times. Look, this is the most important election certainly in my lifetime. This is the most important election in our lifetimes. This November's elections are more important than any I can remember in my lifetime, and that includes when I was on the ballot. This is the most important election of all our lifetimes. And I suppose every time there was an election, uh, politicians said this is the most important election we've ever had. Politicians say every time, oh, this is the most important election. This one's really that important. This is the most important election of our lifetime. This will be maybe the most important election that our country's ever had. This is the most important election. This is the most important election of your lifetime. I certainly think it's the most important election of my lifetime. <laughs> this, is, this is no ordinary election. Voting. How, I, I still can't believe that's real. This, this one request, it's very important. Register to vote. Voting. I, I, I still can't believe that's real. Nothing's more important. Nothing's more important. You need to get everyone you know, get them to register to vote right now. Voting. I, I, I still can't believe that's real. Register to vote. I'm being repetitive for a reason. Nothing is more important. Voting. I, I, I still can't believe that's real. And a lot of people think maybe their vote doesn't count. Well, it does. Okay? It does. Voting. I, I still can't believe that's real. Get everyone you know to register to vote. Voting. I, I, I still can't believe that's real. I'm just being repetitive about this point because it, it is the one takeaway, more than anything, that will matter is getting those registrations and then, and then getting everyone you know to actually vote. And it's the same we have to apply now on a global level. As long as not everybody is vaccinated, nobody will be safe. Voting. I, I, I still can't believe that's real. Vote, vote, vote. I, I, I still can't believe that's real. Vote, vote, vote. Fight, fight, fight. Vote, vote, vote. Voting. I, I, I still can't believe that's real. <laughs>